I thought this was pretty interesting, so today we're going to take a quick look at the AMC Trunnion suspension from the 60s and 70s. The parts that make up this unique suspension include a trunnion, steering knuckle pin, steering arm, lower control arm, a spindle, coil spring, upper control arm, a shock, and a strut rod. Here's a close-up shot of those parts. There's a rebuild kit for the trunnion, so we'll put this together and I'll show you how it works. Last to go on is a washer, lock washer, and nut that has to be torqued. The way this works is the coil spring sits on top of the trunnion, upper control arm goes through here, lower control arm through here with a ball joint, and the spindle right here. When you turn the wheel, and it's a little stiff right now, but it all rides right here on that bearing. So this guy sits right here, and the spring is on top, and the wheel is right here. When it's all put together, it looks something like this. The spring sitting on top of the trunnion, upper control arm, lower control arm, steering arm, and back here is the strut rod. The tie rod is connected to the steering arm and the whole thing, or the wheel, pivots on that bearing. I hope you enjoyed this brief video on the AMC Trunnion suspension. If you did, and you'd like to get my latest videos, don't forget to hit the subscribe button.